a bit of background, the OTR committee was formed this past spring to organize the events leading up to and around the arrival of the torch relay here in Colbert. Chair of the committee is Rebecca goddard Seria, Community Development Officer at Cramie Township, Maureen Young, Crystal Baldry, uh, Elizabeth Kushnick, uh, and myself, Harold Kushnick. Okay, as volunteers, we've worked many hours to bring this together for the community, and so we'd like to really share this and hope that everyone participates on December 15th, which is the magic day. So here's some of the facts you might be interested in. We're scheduled to arrive along number two highway, this is the route here, at Colburn uh, Legion, at 325, weather permitting, of course. Okay. From there, there will be a one-minute photo session designated uh, for a meet-and-greet with the mayor and the runners and other dignitaries. There will be three, tor three torch bearers in all, each running about 300 meters. At this time, their identity has not been made public. Uh, the route will travel here along King Street, as I mentioned, then northward along Percy Street, and our portion of the relay will last a total of nine minutes and end at 32 Percy Street. From there, the torch will leave Colburn at 3.35 and be driven to Coburg via the 401. A detour route has been set up to accommodate local traffic needs. Of course, with so many onlookers expected, drivers should plan ahead and be extra cautious on the local streets. 20 Olympic uh, street banners have been purchased by the committee with funding from the village of Colburn Crammy. These brightly colored banners are already posted in the background behind me. All people are encouraged to attend and show their community support for the relay and for the Olympic Games. We've got um, you know, a lot of good public support. We've had a really high energy committee to put this together, which is yeah. great. Um, and you know, we're starting to hear a lot more word on, right on the street. People are asking questions. So we know we're going to have a, a good amount of people coming out and, and lots of spirit for the street. Students and their families from Colburn Public, South Crammy, Grafton Public and ENSS will be lining the route to witness this historic event. Presentations along the real, real, relay will be made at each of the public schools by Rachel Kushnick one week prior to the torch's arrival so they have the information they need. Several students from each school have volunteered to act as ambassadors and one of their duties will be to help committee members distribute the 1,000 stick flags to onlookers lining the relay route. And here's an example of that flag. There's a front and back to it. Okay. The Royal Canadian Legion, Colbury Night Church and Friendship House will be open as places to warm up and hot chocolate will be available here as well in Victoria Park.